when you're responding, you hit this, turn that, that's all your lights. And you go on, and you're at scene, you can still, now you can control your lights. That's all my lighting. Go to here, it tells me what my levels are. And now if I'm running pressure, I get my pressure on the water. Tells me my water supply, what I got left. Water tank, home tank. <laughs> This one's your, you want to see what's going on back behind you, there you go. If I go over to the vehicle, I can go in here, this is my climate control in here on this screen. Okay, now if I go here to driving, I can turn in my all-wheel steer. So now I can make it steer both axles. This truck can turn around in a two-lane road. Did you get 15 miles, now we're going to lock some street again. Go into info. Tells me what I got. I got 27% battery left, I got 54% of diesel fuel left, and I got 82% of DEF in there yet. Uh, the regenerative braking on this thing, the electrical engines, the electrical motors, and we got regenerative braking, right? So what happened when you let the brake off? It's better than any jig brake I've ever driven. It's just phenomenal. If you drive the truck right you're far enough ahead, you won't use that brake very often. I love selling your battery drops, some of them that you like that. That's the good part, so you get to do all that. And it's just nice. Plus, plus it's putting power back in the battery. Drivability and maneuverability is awesome. Acceleration, insane. You got your two speeds, neutral, you got your drive, and you got turbo mode. Turbo mode is for when you're going up a hill. Like a big one, like straight. These guys in Hollywood Hills, they use it a couple times. They've never run out of power in this truck.